Hi all, welcome to this Team of the Season Oleg Ivanov play review. The Terek Grozny cam is 87 raid, had a Team of the Season last year, was pretty nice. This one is a nice improvement on it, even further. So if you can smash the likes, be awesome, sub to the channel if you're new, follow me on Twitter at G is a legend. All the links are down below for playlists and channel and social media links as always. And if you've caught the Kalachev, Jonatas, or Ari play reviews, it would be awesome. So hopefully you enjoy this one as well. So let's jump into the review. So we have Team of the Season Ivanov. Has played eight games, got me one goal with a price range of twenty-one thousand to seventy thousand coins, and he has seventy-three pace, eighty-one shot, eighty-six pass, eighty-two dribbling, seventy-one defending, and eighty-seven physical. That physical and passing are absolutely godly. They are probably two of his real strong stats about him. Personally, as a centre mid in this team, um, I would probably put. Um, shadow on him is my personal recommendation that would improve that pace which seems to hamper him and his positioning he is quite prone to either going to left or kind of the right side of um, midfield so be prepared for that and maybe look at sorting out his um, uh, um, actions and like tactics but three star weak foot three star skill moves eight games played two assists he did get one goal so I completely ignore that I don't know why it didn't give me the goal but six foot four and is a monster um, 73 sprint speed, 88 stamina, 89 strength, you'd hope he'd have a little bit more with the height and physical, 88 re reactions, 73 acceleration, 89 vision, which is really sound in all honesty, 90 short pass, 86 short power, 83 long pass, 82 long shots, 71 free kicks, which is a bit low in all honesty, 85 dribbling, ball does stick to him like glue with 88 ball control, 73 stand tackle and 75 volleys, cam centre mid, 192 pounds, right footed, medium medium work rates and with long passer is his only trait. In game performances he was n not as good as I thought he would be in all honesty. I think because he was quite bad at jumping across over the wings or even going up to try to be a centre forward you found him out of position at times and it kind of goes against him but whenever you give him a cross or a pass he was always going to do the job for you and that's where I feel his major positives. If you let him just pass and cross he will do the business and kind of anchor that midfield perfectly. As a whole 7 out of 10 could have been a little bit better but still Good value for 20k, so if you enjoy the smash like sub to channel for now and I'll catch you all later.